take a picture of us together with yeah. it before it's all. Like I said, I haven't played Jenga in a long time. All right. Oh! <laughs> I actually oh. don't think that our counters are very level either. I might really regret that. Okay, so explain a little bit about while we're playing, while uh, <laughs> we are precariously <laughs> hoping that this game lasts longer than two blocks, uh, how the training camp has gone for you. Training camp's good. <laughs> this is my fourth time maybe fifth i think this is my fourth winter camp so now i know what to expect really <laughs> the first few years were hard because you just didn't know what to expect but now i know what i'm getting into so um yeah so it's going good it's hard it's hot actually the hottest winter of all of them is this winter really yeah but um i'm racing in campeche like i told yeah. you so i think the heat's gonna be good for me <laughs> this yeah yes well i can put it on still yeah I want right. to take from over here just to level it out. Oh, that, uh, yeah, you're a veteran right there. You do well in hot weather races, though, yeah. right? Yeah, no, I definitely like the heat. Heat and great. sun? Um, yeah, all of it. Really? I mean, but I have no desire to go race like the crazy hot, like in Asia or anything crazy hot like that. So well, That's just like running in soup. Oh, I got a question. Oh, you got a question. Oh, this is the impossible one. What? Yeah, right, Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> How many atoms are in a pencil eraser, eraser from Sarah True? <laughs> I don't even know. Do you want to take a guess? I think it's probably going to be close to a billion. I would think trillions. One, yeah. One trillion. It's like several hundred billion trillion. Whoa. But she knew that. No, she didn't oh. have a clue. She oh, just okay. started writing it and laughing. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, we are on precarious footing. Yeah, this house is not the most stable. I feel like we're playing but, risky Jenga. We are. Uh, <laughs> oh, no way. What was the toughest day here? Probably the first few days were the toughest just because the heat coming from um, at home. Yeah, we did like a couple really long days just for heat acclimation and then intensity. Um, so yeah, I always find the first and also West Coast to East Coast, so the time change and so I find the first few days the toughest, but um, I'm an Ironman athlete with a diesel engine, so I feel like I'm just getting going now. So really, yeah, getting Three, warmed up. <laughs> what is this? This is we're on days? day. Yeah, it's 17 days, and we're on day nine. So we have like basically a week left oh. from today. Oh, I thought we were yeah. towards the end. No, oh, we got no, a week. you're all just warming up. Yeah, exactly. It's probably a dumb move to make. Intensity wise, was yesterday um, like most volume with intensity? Yeah, yesterday we usually do one ride a week with that's long with high intensity, and then one ride a week that's more like 70.3 to Ironman intensity. And okay. then yesterday just kind of built. So, like, our last 20 minute interval probably for me was close to like really high end 70.3 watts or even Olympic distance. So. You said you, you averaged 260. Yeah. That's that was Coca-Cola. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we're running out of ones that want to. Oh, 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 I see the one with the question. Oh, and it's Lucy Goosey even. Okay. Oh, this is from Laura. How many good oh, how many gold medals did Great Britain win at London 2012? I don't do, know on that one either. Do you have a guess? 33. I think she might have it. It's 29. 29? Oh! oh. <laughs> That's pretty close. I couldn't remember what it was either. <laughs> These are questions for me too. Yeah, I don't know if I like this, but let's live dangerously. <laughs> YOLO. <laughs> oh my goodness, the structural integrity is just falling apart. How do the training days here compare to what you do at home? 
Um, it's different every year, but this year I put in a pretty good base in winter. Um, so I've come here before not prepared at all. And so then the days here are just like each day's living hell. It's like literally boot camp. But um, this year I started training a bit earlier and I didn't get as out of shape after Kona. Um, I mean, I definitely took an off season, but sometimes my off seasons will go like two, three months, just too long. Um, so this year it's not that bad. Like I was doing pretty close to what we're doing at home here. So um, that's kind of nice. And it's easier here because it's outdoor miles versus indoor riding. And um, But yeah, it just depends. Like some people come in with not much fitness. Some people come in with a lot of miles. But um, I came in with a pretty good base. So, so far it hasn't been that crazy. Whoa, we're running out of options. <laughs> I really did a number on us with that first one. Yeah, you just went right out of the... Yeah. Have you guys been to Claremont before? No. It's an interesting it's, place, huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's making a very solid case for a... Ooh. I regret this decision. For a, like, winter residence for a while. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's great weather. It's inexpensive. How do you <laughs> compare here to Tucson? Oh. <laughs> Have you done Tucson? Yeah, I've done Tucson. I actually was in Tucson for a couple weeks this winter, and yeah, I'm going to give the nod to Tucson. <laughs> really? Yeah, well, there's a lot of mountains in Tucson. I'm a mountain girl, and West Coast, it's easy for us to get to. Easy. <laughs> easy stuff. I'm like, give me that one's just on one right now. We're so screwed. How about this for an off-the-board question? How many times have you FaceTimed with chimmy well i've been here nine days so nine times really <laughs> we haven't done a daily double yet <laughs> <laughs> she's the cutest yeah she's awesome look at you seasoned veteran that one just wanted yes <laughs> i just don't want to be the one that tips it over there you go. <laughs> oh, it's, it's tight though. It's really oh, tight. Oh no! You got it. Oh, oh. Darn it, that means it's going to oh. be me. Nope. Oh! <laughs> ah. First win of the year for the competition. Wow. One for the triathletes, pro triathletes. <laughs> Good work. <laughs> good game, good game. Yeah, a I thought game. you had it for sure. I was like, oh, you know what? Man. It came out so well. There was a moment when it like got loose. And I'm like, uh, I got it. A, yeah, this is easy. <laughs> Choose your block wisely and uh, don't ask questions about atoms. No, <laughs> I won't. No physics. A uh, what do we do? Like a conversation starter. Why don't you tell people on the video where they can look you up on online? You can look me up online at Lindsay Corbin. It's L-I-N-S-E-Y, so no D, uh, Corbin. And I'm on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Strava. All over. Training Peaks, <laughs> Garmin Connect, you name it. One, yep. <laughs> one of the best Instagrams in the biz. Yes, um, all right. And an excellent game, thank you. Yeah, that was mm -hmm. awesome. All right, where and when was your first triathlon? Okay, there we go. I like it. I'm gonna be rattled for the next couple hours about this. We gotta go play two more games and I'm just coming off of a loss. 